question to yourself. Is there a way for us to have green buildings where it is all powered by the power of Mother Nature? Well, the Tricidia Complex, these dreams have became a reality. All right. Well, you see, the Tricidia Complex runs off of three main energy sources. You have solar energy, you have wind energy, and geothermal energy. We have Todd Quinter from Huntington Area Middle School. Uh, STEM this year has been uh, great. We've just started introducing it into our middle school as part of our program. And for my class, we were doing it as an enrichment activity. So we got four students to come out and present uh, their STEM project today. They had a great time doing it. We really appreciate it. Uh, I'm going to talk about the floors and how much weight it holds. So this floor is different than these four because it's not for the weight. These are, they have a lot more support. Uh, it holds 5.1 pounds and the bottom weights are heavier than the top ones. So say you have elephants here and then you have birds up here. So not a few things. Um, I'm going to talk about the support beams. So these support beams hold a lot of weight and they don't cost a lot and they use a lot less pieces. So that really helped us. Originally, our original design was to build a base around the building. We didn't like that design, and it cost a lot and didn't really hold. So we decided to go on to this. I also liked it. We worked as a team well. We found out a good strategy. We worked as a team. 